Hi guys, it's Emma and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, I'm Emma and welcome to Emma's little channel. Today's video is going to be a haul kind of thing, like an August haul, end of summer haul kind of thing. I'm not really sure what I'm going to call it yet, but I've been shopping. So I thought I'd do another haul for you guys. <laughs> Just before the video starts, I'd like to address a few things because there are a few different things. One, the first thing is really obvious, we have a new background. Um, I was kind of getting bored of just over here having a plain white background and I thought behind this little thing here would be cool because I've got like this board of like, I don't know what this was, but like this board of like all my memories and stuff. And I just thought it'd be cool and a little bit more different, um, even if it does mean I have to carry up a chair upstairs and a mirror, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> the second thing is, I don't know if you'll be able to tell on camera, some people can, some people can't, but I have bleached my hair or I haven't, my stepmom did bleach it for me. Um, so yeah, I'm now a little bit more blonder. The last thing that's different is I have my nose pierced now. <laughs> I had it pierced probably a week ago or two weeks ago as you're watching this. I'm not sure because this has been pre-filmed as I do start college. The week this goes up, I think. Um, so yeah, that's that. <laughs> if you watch my back to school, uh, not back to school, my GCC results video, then you will know that I bleached my hair and I got my nose pierced, so. We're just going to move on from that now. <laughs> so, as I did say, today's video is a end of summer kind of haul thing. Um, so yeah, if you'd like to see what I've been wasting my money on this month, then let's get on with the video. So, as a few of you may know, I am turning 17 in August. Oh, Emma, you don't know when your birthday is. I'm turning 17 in November and that means I'm going to be starting college in September. So the first thing I have is my new college bag. It's just a plain, really black bag with like a pocket on the front and it's going weird because I have stuff in it. This is from New Look and it was £22, I think. Um, so yeah, it's just really nice. It's got some of my school stuff inside already. I don't know if you'll be able to see. Um, but yeah, it's just a nice spacious bag that I've been using a lot recently actually, even though it was bought for school. I just find it can fit everything in it and because I'm going to be in college, I don't know what I'm going to be taking. It'll be different day to day. So it's just got room for near enough everything. I think this is a tote bag. I'm not sure. It's either a tote, tote bag or just a normal like, hair bag. But it's just an easy one to carry around. Like I can just put it on my shoulder and it's done. Um, so yeah, it's just a really simple black bag and I picked it up in black because Black goes with every outfit, and obviously because when you're in college you can wear whatever you want. I thought black because it would just go with everything rather than having a brown bag and stuff like that. So yeah, I picked up this bag from New Look. <laughs> Next thing I picked up is also from New Look, and it is just a two-piece bikini. Um, this is just a really nice one because basically, <laughs> the story behind this is I went to the Clacton Air Show um, last weekend as you're watching this, it had been like two weeks ago. My whole step family was going in like the sea there and everything. And I kind of wanted to go but I didn't have a swimming costume. So my dad let me buy a swimsuit and this just, this just has high waisted um, mesh bottoms. And obviously it's got like a black bit here so you're protected and no one sees anything. And this was actually in the sale. I think the bottoms were £9 and the top was £10. The top is just like a really nice, um, to neck kind of top as well again it's got cups so you don't see anything it's just a really nice simple one which i just think is kind of essential just to have something that you really like and again it's in black because i like black clothes <laughs> together this came to about 19 20 pounds and i just think it's a really good bargain really for just a nice swimsuit and the next thing is something that i'm actually wearing on my wrist now it is this um, Pandora bracelet. I'll do a close-up of it after I've finished speaking. But my mum bought this for me, so I, I didn't technically buy it. But she bought it for me yesterday as a congratulations present for passing my GCSEs. Or There's a spider in the corner of my room. Just die! I'm petrified of spiders. <laughs> um, yeah, my mum bought this bracelet for me because it's just she wanted to buy me something just to say like congratulations and everything. And I have tiny wrists and this is literally the smallest size they sell. But it, I just think it's a really nice, simple bracelet. It's so, so pretty, and I literally, I'm scared to wear it, but I kind of want to wear it, so I wear it kind of thing. I don't want it to just sit there and not be worn. So I'm wearing it right now, and yeah, I really like it, so thank you, Mum. And I think this was 25 pounds from Pandora. I don't know if I said it, if it was from there or not. 
If you watch my vlogs frequently, if you don't, more Emma, shout out link in the description. You will know that I ran out of my Maybelline Baby Skin Primer, so I went into Superdrug the other week and picked up this Elf, Elf? Elf Tone Adjusting Face Primer. This does come in a box, but I lost the box because I needed to use it ASAP. Um, but yeah, this is basically like a green colour correcting primer, but it also fills in um, fine lines and stuff like that. And because I have, I think it's called rosacea, I'm not 100% sure, I think that's how you pronounce it. I have that really bad on my cheeks and like basically all over my face. And this helps with it so much. Yeah, this was £7.50, so if you're looking at buying this, yeah, it's, the shade is neutralising green. If you're looking at buying this, it's definitely a really, really good one to buy from Superdrug. One thing I will say about it though is if you don't like silicone primers, this one probably isn't for you because if you like the Benefit Professional one, it's a little bit more silicone-y, I don't even know if that's a word, I'm going to have a word for it, than the Benefit Professional, but this one does also um, counteract redness, which is why I use it, so yeah. The last few things I picked up this month are actually from Primark and some of them are for school and some of them are just everyday necessity kind of things. The first thing is a nail kit and I really like this because I'm not quite sure why it's wobbling. My old one was really really old, I think I've had it since probably year 9 and it was basically falling apart and it was disgusting, it was covered in stuff. The things that held all the bits inside have broken and I just was in need of a new one. So when I went into Primark and saw, oh, I almost threw it then, and saw this one here was one pound. One pound. I kind of couldn't resist it and it also just opens when you press the button instead of having a zip so it's a lot more easier to use. And inside you just have the usual, you've got a nail file, tweezers, I don't really know what these are for, um, nail clippers and scissors and I just think this is going to come in really really handy, it's going to go straight in my like emergency kit in college and um, so yeah I also love the print on it like some of them were the same inside but they had a different print and were more expensive so I just picked up this one because it was a pound and it's literally like I love the colours on it and I love the print um, so yeah if you're looking for a new nail kit I definitely recommend the ones from Primark because they're cheap and yet they look like they're going to be really good. The next thing I picked up from Primark was this makeup bag and originally I was going to use this as a pencil case because I felt like I had loads and loads of stationery. If you haven't watched my stationery haul then just click up here and it will be right there for you guys. Um, yeah, I was going to use this for my stationery but then I realised it was way too big when I put all of my stuff in, like it was only half full. In the end I decided to use this as my survival kind of kit thing. Um, so inside it's just going to have hand sanitizer, hair bands, bobby pins, plasters, tampons, um, makeup touch-ups, just kind of stuff like that. And obviously the nail kit, just things that I will need that I usually forget. Um, so yeah, this was a t like £3.50 and all the makeup bags in Primark were really cheap as well. I'm not quite sure why they were so cheap, but um, yeah, it's a really good size one as well. It also has a pocket in the back which I find really helpful because most of my makeup bags don't have that yet. Like it's got a pocket here, I don't know if you can see. Um, so yeah, this is definitely going to come in really handy because it's spacious, like I said already. So I'm going to be able to fit a lot in here. And also, can we just talk about the print? Like this is again, like such a cute print. I'm not literally kill it with their prints. But it feels like it's really good quality, so it's like a leather bag. And it's just got so like pretty flowers on it. And I love it so much. It's just... I love it. <laughs> the next thing I picked up from Primark is a new purse because my other one has actually like fallen apart and I've been looking for a new purse for literally probably a year and a half now and I've keep, I kept seeing this one in new look that I wanted but it was like £12 and I can't really justify spending £12 on something that's going to hold my money. Where did you come from? This was only £5 from Primark and I absolutely love it. I love the colour, I love the design of it because it's got like a separate bit for cash and a separate bit for coins and I've already put all of my stuff in it so yeah I've just got all my cards here and my notes and then receipts and then inside here I've just got my coins there's not many because I'm poor like I said this was only five pounds and this is such good quality like my last purse was from Belgium when I went there so I must have had that since like year eight because that's when I went on the trip to Belgium. I was just bored of it. It was just brown and I just didn't like it and it was just falling apart really. So I asked my mum if I could get this and she said yes. So I picked up this and it was, like I said, it was only five pounds, which can we, can we just have a moment like this? This was only five pounds, so. 
yeah. The last thing I picked up from Primark is kind of boring, but I also kind of needed them. If you know me, or if you go to school in England, you'll know most of the uniform is literally black. You have to have black socks, black trousers, black blazer, and stuff like that. And all of my socks were like the really, really long ones, and I cannot stand long socks that like come up to my legs. I prefer ankle socks, so I picked up a pair, or a pair, um, a pack of ankle socks because I like these. I just don't know why, but I don't like long socks. So I picked up these, and these were only £2.50 for seven um, pairs, and I don't know, I just really like them. You get so many different colours, like you get luminous pink, blue, white, green, grey, darker blue, and baby pink. And yeah, I just think these are going to be good, they're going to be used, and yeah. So that was it for this haul, I hope you guys all enjoyed it, and if you did, don't forget to leave a thumbs up, as that would help me out so much. If you're new here, then don't forget to subscribe, the button is right down here, and don't forget to press the bell button just to be notified every single time I upload, and sometimes I do upload in the week as well. Also, if you don't already know, I have started doing weekly vlogs on my vlogging channel, which is More Emma, or if you want to subscribe, click the link below. Yeah. That was it from me guys, I hope you all enjoyed this video and I will see you all next week with a brand new one. Bye!